in this video we are going to dodge and burn by drawing some lines yes it looks as simple as it is so without wasting any kind of time let's jump in photoshop Welcome back everyone, my name is Nan Chaudhary from Tasty Tutorials and in this video as I already told you we are going to learn about dodge and burning with drawing some lines. Well it is not a traditional methods by using dodge and burn tool, in uh, we can say the original method we do dodge and burn by using uh, uh, this dodge and burn tool by creating uh, a 50% grey layer or on original layer it's all on your choice. So before we start let me just show you what is dodge and burn. Uh, dodge and burn is a technique in which uh, we actually bright or dark the certain areas of an image to show some lights to show some darkness of the image and to show some dimensions actually let me just show you what actually it works and uh, we will learn some new technique in this video this is our image we are going to use today so let's get started first of all uh, what we need to do is we will go to this uh, curves or adjustment layers or you can just go from here just click on this menu and click on curves adjustment layer right now uh, first we will use and click and uh, pick it up and you will see it will it will come up with brightest areas of the image I think it will be enough for us uh, yeah right here so don't be worried about that you can uh, shoot up the colors I know that so just hide this up and what we'll do is we will name this as uh, you can say bright nice and just select or click on this mask button or mask uh, shape and press ctrl i to invert this color to black now we will create another curves adjustment layer and uh, this time we will go dark side of this image so i think it's uh, it's it's good enough for here for us here so nice now we'll hide this up and same thing we will rename this to um, dark okay now click on this image uh, mask and press ctrl i to invert this mask to convert into into black and now what we'll do is we will uh, click on our bright layer and i will use our brush tool and uh, just uh, size it up our brush zoom it in into our image nicely and now what we'll do is we will draw some lines and uh, curved lines however you like uh, to on the lighter area you can see there is the light contracting on our character so right here right here nice now you can see that we have drawn the lines on where the bright side is shown I mean that uh, where the light is coming or attached or uh, contacting with our image now we'll turn on this and what we'll do is we'll double click on this we just need to open properties you can just go to windows and go to uh, here is the properties you can see or you can just double click on this mask and the properties will be open now we'll click on this feather and you will see slowly slowly and uh, here we go this is the best way of dodging nice it's nice but it's uh, too we can say that sharp i think it's nice here 45 and now you can see dodge and burn works properly now same thing for the dark side we will choose the dark areas of the image by drawing on line on it so we'll press b we'll hide it up and draw lines nice so i have selected the dark side of uh, dark Im uh, dark parts of the image and now what we'll do is we'll double click on this uh, layer mask again and uh, we will call up feather and we'll uh, slowly vanish the feather so where you will feel better not here not here 
here and you can see this is the dark side so now if you turn on both you will see the things but if you see the colors are too much brighten up so select both of these layers and it will change the uh, colors to luminosity so this is the way you can uh, do dodge and burn so it all depends on your choice how you work on dodge and burning so this is the quickest way i hope you like this video if you like this video and found this video helpful make sure to give this video a thumbs up don't forget to share and subscribe we will meet in our next video take care be happy and be creative